everybody. Happy New Year 2019. Oh my God, where did 2018 go? Holy moly. All right, so this is going to be my 2019 planner. My goal for 2019 is to be extremely organized. I don't think that it's an unrealistic goal. I think I can do it. So I decided not to buy a happy planner or a Heidi Swap planner or any of the planners out there. I decided I needed to make my own planner geared towards my life. So I customized a binder. I got a cramp in my leg, sorry. Um, I customized a binder that I got from the Dollar Tree back in September that I fell in love with. And I'm gonna repeat this over and over again. You guys can get nuts, get, you know. But my goal for 2019 is to use what I have. So I had this and I'm gonna use it. Now I'm gonna show you my planner. I'm gonna share with you. All right. So inside my planner, it goes like this. Oh, look at this, we can do it in one shot. Yay. All right, so inside my planner, it goes like this. Over here, this is going to be, and I'm gonna print out a beautiful sticker. This is gonna be my gratitude journal. For my December daily, I picked five things a day that I was grateful for. Five things a day, it's not hard to do. This is going to become my gratitude journal. Oh, that's a little messed up. This was also a Dollar Tree from September, back to school stuff. And I'm just gonna keep it and write down the five things I'm grateful for, and then the blurb about what the day was like. And that's gonna go right there. This is gonna get filled with um, the pens that I like to use in my journal. And I have specific pens that I like. They're colored pens. I like to, to change things up, color them, decorate. So that's gonna go in here. Yay! And then here comes 2019. 2019. This book's never leaving my office. So if found, please return to me. <laughs> now, these are from Vinnie and Shannon's Etsy store, which is the Vinnie Shannon Paper Co. I know you've all heard me say this. I did do a video on his latest designs, but his planner stuff was amazing. Um, we weren't collaborating on his designs. He does this all on his own. But when I printed them out, I was like, oh my God, this was the thought process I had for my specific planner. Look at that, a year at a glance. Love that. Then birthdays and important dates. I'm gonna fill this in. I didn't wanna do it beforehand because I wanted to shoot the video blank. I have a few goals for 2019. Places I really would like to see in 2019. A few New Year's resolutions that I'm gonna see if I can keep for within the month. I'll see what I come up with. And one year from now, I wanna see, I wanna see, I'm gonna write a few things down. I'll probably share that throughout the year. Mood tracker, oh my God. I'm so into this. This alone made me like, wow. So I'll color in each one of these squares, and then I'm going to um, color in the, the squares on a daily basis and see where I come up with. How many days am I in happy, content, angry, sad, or tired? Blah. So I'm gonna do that. Then I'm gonna fill in my daily cleaning schedule, my monthly, my weekly, and every so often. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that. I think that's pretty cool. Daily routine. I want to have one, and this might change weekly, monthly, who knows? I might have to add to this. We'll see. My spending habits. I think this is going to be for my crafts, because my goal for my crafts is to not buy. Only necessities. And I really have to put a definition on the word necessity. I really do. Um, but I will be doing my CVS and my Dollar General hauls because those are really staples in our household when I do those hauls. 2019, 
what shows to watch. We all have great shows, favorite shows, and want movies to watch. Oh my God, God now I'm so excited. Yay! Look at this beautiful paper. This paper just screams excitement. It really does. This is part of their paper line. And this is gonna be my daily goals. Now this is geared just to me. I actually did this spreadsheet in Google Spreadsheets, which is so easy to use. If you haven't used it, go try it. One of the, <laughs> one of the young adults, Vinny's friends, did one for me, and I'll share that with you in another video. But once he sat down at my computer and did it, I was like, I could do that. So I'm going to share with you my monthly goal. This will be for January, but it's a daily goal. All right. I'm going to zoom you in because you really only need to see the top. Now, I take medicine three times a day. You don't need to know what meds, but I take it. So one has to be taken as soon as I wake up. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna start drinking orange juice every day. I really don't drink enough water or vitamin C. I don't. And that's gonna be a new goal. So I'm gonna drink a glass of orange juice a day. I wanna read, I have a bunch of these books. Um, Sunsets with God, um, readings for women, things like that. And they're just quick little blurbs and books. And I wanna read that every day, just a blurb. Then I want to work on my planner. I want to have my coffee, which is important to me. Then this is for you all. I want to get better at replying to your comments. I don't do that. I'm so not good at that. I really, I stink at that with texting, Facebook messages. I, I, I reply in my head. I never reply on paper or through messaging. I'm getting chilly. Um, so I want to do that on a daily basis. Then I want to do one act of kindness a day. That's it. Whether it's a, a Facebook message where I say something positive, or if I message somebody, or I just do something kind or pay it forward throughout the day. That is a huge goal of mine for, I'm going to do it monthly for this month. Like I said, this might change for February. Then I'll take my second dose of my medicine. Then I want, to, uh, I want to organize one drawer in my house a day. If I get to two, I get to two. If I get to three, whatever. I want to organize something in my house every day for the month of January. Then I do have a fitness goal. And I'll get on to that when I get into my fitness section on my planner. But for me to go down my basement, I have an elliptical, I have a treadmill, I have workout equipment. There's no reason why I can't get on my treadmill for 20 minutes a day. That's it. And then I want to do um, that gratitude journal that I showed you right here. And I'm going to mark that off on my daily every day. Then I take my third med at night before I go to bed. And then I have five ec extra spots to add things if I want to do them. And honestly, it should be, tell someone you love them. But that's part of the kindness thing, right? Okay. So that is my daily for the month of January. And like I said, it'll change. I'm sure it will change. Now we go on to, look at that paper. Loving this. If this doesn't scream happy, I don't know what it does. Um, so now I'm going to go on to my calendar. This is just a monthly at a glance. And I'm going to fill this in with all of my family's special dates, birthdays, anniversaries, you know it, okay? And I'll do this in all different color markers, and then I, I get my stamp pad out and I do some stamping. And this here is blank because I want to decorate it throughout the month of January. Um, and I want to see where I go or throughout the year. Now, this is another cut apart from Vinnie and Shannon's paper. And there are a few books I want to read, and I'm going to go find them, and I think I'm going to put them in these little spots. And I'm going to write down seven goals. It's not hard to be, do, and they could start small. And if I wanted to, I could print this out again, lay it on top, and, and make it brad, and, and maybe do this monthly. Maybe I'll make that. I think that's what I'm going to do. This is going to be January. 
January goals. Ha, let's see if I can do that. Then I thought these were so great, so I wanted to decorate this side of it. The scissors, which is a staple in our craft room, a paintbrush. Happiness lies in the joy of achievement and the thrill of creative effort. Franklin D. Roosevelt. Create. This screams us crafters. And now this is just the week at a glance. So this is the first week of January, second week, third week, and I printed these out myself on my print shop, and I did front and back. Ta-da! Then this was just another folder that was part of the Dollar Tree stuff, and it matched the binder. And I'll probably be filling this throughout the year, maybe adding a second folder, depending on my needs. These are little sticky notes that my BFF, Rena, friend uh, sent me. And you always need sticky notes, so that's going to stay in here. Yay! Look at the next one. Now, this one is going to be medical. Unfortunately, you turn 50, and next thing you know, it's all about the medicine. And I did start with John, Donna, TJ, Vinny, and I think I want to add, because like I said, Danica is at the emergency room right now. I want to include Danica and I'm going to grab two blank pages from the back of my book. Because I was just going to do, I guess, my immediate, but they are my immediate. Who am I kidding? I actually only need one in here. This is going to be Quinn. This is going to be Tierney, Vinny, and Shannon. And I'll fill these in because you know what? You just don't remember things and days turn into blurs. That's what I'm going to do. I think I'm on a good, good, good schedule so far. Okay, so I thought this was really cool. Ha! Huh. This is from Vinny and Shannon's paper com company. And it's just a fun way to fill in. Like maybe cut out a picture of movies you like, maybe movies you want to see. I think. I think this is going to become a fun thing for me. I really am. I'm going to, and I'm going to come back and do maybe, maybe at the end of the week or every two weeks, I'll go over my planner with you. Planner videos are pretty fun. Um, this is a private schedule. I didn't fill in the rest. And uh, maybe I'll share this with you. I mean, we all have, uh, actually, you know what? What the heck? I have, um, IBSC. And I know I've spoken to a couple of girls, and um, I'm not the only one. IBSC is irritable bowel syndrome with constipation. If it's too much information, please fast forward. But if you love me, you do. You want to, you know, we all want to hear about each other. We're all a family on here. We're all a group. So anyways, I need to start keeping track of my schedule. And I'm probably going to go get that little emoji. Huh. Here, I'll make you laugh. <laughs> okay, you ready? <laughs> if we can't laugh about it, what can we do? There's the little emoji. <laughs> oh my gosh. I am going to have a endoscopy um, this month. And I'll fill you in on that too. But anyways, I need to keep a schedule. Hope I made you all laugh. Then we go on to ooh, another pretty page. And this is going to be auto. John usually keeps track of all the auto stuff. But he's kind of slacking lately. And I thought it wouldn't be such a bad thing for me to have in the house. And I'll go back. See, I left these all blank. I'm going to decorate them. So. The auto, I'm going to start keeping track of because I do all the purchasing of the parts. So, um, I want to keep track of things. So, I listed all of our cars in here, even our classics. Sorry, I don't know who's here. I had to let the dogs out. So, all right. So, 
I do have a few fitness goals for the year. And I know we all start off that way, but I really am praying that I can actually get back my life that I once had before this medical stuff happened. So these are also cut apart from their paper, the kids' paper company. So I did weigh myself. I do weigh myself every day because of the IBSC. Um, I weigh 138.4. My goal is to be 128. 10 pounds. That's not a lot. And I know people that do it. So why can't I do it? So I thought this was really cool. So what they should have done was, and, or for me, for my goal, I'm going to do this once a month, but this only gets me through um, the 10th. And I can write them in. I have a white pen, which I love. And I'm going to, I like the fact that this is a black and white theme. Good things take time. I put my goal down. I'll probably color this in with a pencil. How bad do you really want it? I want it bad. Be active. I'm a very active soul, but I don't know what it is. We'll see. I think I have to be happier, but, um, be more active. Be happy. I plan on it. And I really try to be. Be healthy. Ah, from, from my lips to God's ears. The only bad workout is the one you didn't do. Amen. Sore today, strong tomorrow. Yay! This is just a medal that I think I'll, I'll color that in when I hit my goal. Fitness tracker for me. Um, and it says go! On your mark, get set, and go! Then the next thing is, how pretty is this, right? This is called the Mandela. Mandala? Mandala paper line. Absolutely loving this. I'm still, like I said earlier, I'm still going to do my CVS walls, and I like to document it. So what I spend, what I save, and who knows, there might become a spreadsheet in here. And then I want to continue doing, look how pretty, my Dollar Generals. Then in this one, loving that too, is household info. And what I mean by household info, it is we have a water filter. And those filters have to be changed every three months. I want to start keeping track of that. Then um, what else has to be changed? Just like different things that have to be done within the house. So I decided I was going to do just a house section. Now, these are some of the extra cut parts that I haven't used yet. And this one, I so want to use. I just have to figure out how I'm going to do it. Because I want to keep track of the weather. And I think that this might become... I don't know. I'm still working on this thought process in my head. Maybe this is the one... I don't know. Bear with me on that one. I'm going to decorate with these. How stinking cool are these? Hey, wait, do you remember being a kid? Oh my God, this just came to me. Didn't we color in a circle and you put it on string? And then when you pulled it, it turned? How the heck do you make that? Wouldn't these be great if we put it on a piece of chipboard? Not chipboard. Chipboard, maybe, but even cardstock. And then when you pulled it, oh my God, if you know what I'm talking about, please leave me a comment below. Oh my God, could you imagine what that would look like? I'm going to have to find that. Another habit tracker, to-do list. I cut that out. I do want to figure this one out. I want to... I want to drink water. And how many does he have on here? Ten cups of water a day? Is that how many you're supposed to drink? I have to ask him. This probably should sit right on my desk. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Or I should make my own sheet where it's seven. Oh, cut it out. All right, I got some more planning to do. I don't think that this is something I will use. Maybe it will. I don't know. I don't know what 1K is. What is 1K? I'll have to ask him. 
You can do this. Don't give up. Never give in. It gets easier. Something good, something bad, something interesting. That would be pretty cool in my... In my... Uh, gratitude. Huh. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, snack, calories. I'm not going to count calories, so this doesn't work for me. But if you're a person that wants to count calories, this is something pretty cool. This is a cool 30-day calendar, monthly, um, to track your habits or to track your workouts. I might do a menu. I might do another. I might have a couple of different books going. That might be another video. But this was just done in a different color in case your theme wasn't the color that you chose. All right, so these are all basically the same. Loving that. But I am going to do a shopping list book or pad. I'm going to work on that. But this is my planner for the year 2019. I hope you enjoyed walking through it with me. Um, I hope you'll go check out Vinnie and Shannon's paper company. Please leave me a comment below. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like, that thumbs up button. Um, it means so much to me. And Happy New Year. And let's make 2019 epic. That's going to be my new tagline. Let's make 2019 epic. All right, everybody. Have a great day. And I will see you all real soon. Bye.